Well, I hope you enjoyed Nuts and Mare. Yes, and we can now have a look at the new Slimline to Harry Seacombe. Oh, oh, well, hey, indeed. Looks like it works. Well done, Harry. Yes, and now over to Pat and Dave for the late regional news headlines. Earlier reports about the gentleman in Bury wearing tan shoes have proved slightly misleading. David. That's right, yes. Because they weren't actually tan coloured shoes. They were more the sort of like oatmeal, beige biscuit type of uh, colour, you know. Sort of like coffee au lait, Aye. if you're that way inclined. Or uh, perhaps an envelope, if you're more au fait with the stationery. That's right. Uh, of... uh, what Aye. we're basically saying, I think, is that uh, the police are now looking for a gentleman with what is envelope coloured shoes. Aye, yeah. So keep your eye out for him if you can. Eggy one. Or oh, eggy one, as Aye. Dave very helpfully says. Aye. Now, Aye. the big story tonight, of course, was the loss of David's mintolas. Aye. Now, I'm pleased to say, David, we've had a pack of mintolas handed in. Aye. Eh? When did they come in, then? They came in earlier, Dave. Eh? Why well, wasn't I informed? There's no need to inform you well, now. Well, you inform me quicker, Billy boy. Come on, give us one. Nay, I'm going to check if they're yours, lad. Eh? I'm checking if they're yours first. Of course, man. Who else had walked down the street with, with mint trawlers? Oh, eh, man? Give they're a one. very popular sweet, David. Come on, give us one. I'm gagging. You're going to... I'm going to test if they're yours first, David. I don't <laughs> care how long it takes. <laughs> now, how many was left in your pack? Three. Fair enough. Now, did you twizzle the end to keep them fresh? Of course I was twizzle the end to keep the freshness in. No, it's, a, it's a good Stupid. Idea. That's a very good tip for your people at home as well, if you're the yeah. eaters. Now, had the uh, chocolate gone it, gone it all powdery, uh, David? Well, do you know, Pat, it had been left outside, so it probably had done. Now, give us them. No, yes, one but you, you hold your asses, lad. Yeah. Now, had you written the phone number on the wrapper? Ah, I suppose I could have done, aye. How oh, well did you or not? Ah, oh, maybe I did, aye. Oh, eight, nine, eight, busty dwarf. No, I didn't. I didn't, didn't, I didn't, and they're not mine, then. Is they're that what yours. you want? They're not mine. No, they're not yours. Yeah. Oh, you man, give us them. No, look, Dave, I didn't think they were yours, actually, so I brought you some of my toffets. I you don't want, want a toffet. I hate toffets. You can stick them up with your jacksy, man. Oh, come on, have a Christmas toffet. Go on, give us the bloody mentors, man. Do you not want a toffet? No, I don't want a toffet. Ah, oh, we'll stuff you, then. Finally, tonight, regarding Thank the Sutton Coalfield uh, wind story, it never actually arrived, did the wind, that is, and so uh, we can just... David, will you get off them mint oh, hey, man! Get off them! Give us one, I'm desperate! I know you're desperate! Look, you're... I'm begging you, man! Give us a mint! David, calm yourself down, we're on air still! I'm desperate for a cube mint sweet! I know you are, you can smell them, can't you? They're not your mint -tolas. Well, who's are they? I don't know, do I? Can't you just have a chopper? Give us a mint tola, man! No chance! Get out of here! I'll break your neck! I don't care, you're not having any of these mint tolas! I'll break your neck! Well, thank you for joining us, ladies and gentlemen, in the slightly hostile environment of our home. And can we leave you with this thought? It only takes a minute to say goodbye. But a lifetime to say au revoir. Goodbye. Au revoir. Bob? Yep? It doesn't take a minute to say goodbye. It takes about a half a second. I know, I noticed that. Then it was over like that, wasn't it? Stupid! But you stretched it to up two seconds. Stupid it? advice! Hey, Vic, got a year to say au revoir, though, eh? Maybe a week if you were drunk. You'd have to be completely <laughs> drunk. <laughs> what? Where's that puppy? Well, I don't know. Do you think I am a dog expert? I, what, how, do, how do you think? I, 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 uh, how am I supposed to know where dogs go when they die? What do you mean when they die? I don't, I don't know. I didn't say anything. What do you mean? Come on, let's just go to bed. Will you read us that story, though? Of course I will. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Are you ready? Get chucked in. You in? Right. Oh, calamity ejaculated Timmy. I'll bring my oxyacetylene welding equipment made from blueberries and water. Is that, sorry, is that, is that like real blueberries? Or? Of course it's real, isn't there? Fresh blueberries. Fresh blueberries, um. yes. And water leaves. And my helmet made from strawberry pips and puff pastry. And where's it? Would there be real strawberries? Do you want me to read this story? Yes, what? Sorry, sorry, carry on. Yeah. That should do the trick. So off they scampered to the scene of the wing lodgement incident. And no sooner had they arrived than they saw old farmer... Wait, wait. How long did it take to arrive? And half an hour. Is that all right? Is that all right? Is that simple?